Now imagine buying a box of tomato for 50 CDs and selling it for 500 CDs. Well, that's the tale of the farmer and the market woman. Sandra Fenu visited some farms at uh, Koleodo in the Greater Kwa region and reports some traders make as much as 1,000% profit on a box of tomato, leaving the farmer in abject poverty. Huago Tete Steven entered into farming after dropping out of school at the senior high level due to financial difficulties. At age 25, he cultivates about four acres of tomato farm at Koleado in the Greater Accra region. Despite working hard over the years, he tells me his toil is yet to change his standard of living. Inconsistent rain patterns has affected his crops, resulting in low yields. We are expecting like uh, 50 bushes of uh, tomatoes to, to come out of the, the five hectares of land. But as you are seeing there, it's only two bushes of uh, tomatoes that we have, so it's, it's, it's no good at all. Another farmer, Ebenezer, described farming as a waste of time. According to him, after months of sweat on the farm, the end result is heartbreaking. If we are down the farmers, we suffer a lot. And even we lose in farming. Because even fertilizer, they, now we are, they are selling fertilizer almost 66. Compounding the situation, they said market women were milking them. This box of tomato, for instance, was sold for 60 cities. We can say we are agri. It is agri, no, contain no. So we buy, no, we buy, we buy, Ghana. This is agri, and the market women buy a basket for 60 Ghana. The box of rhino is 30 Ghana. Rhino, no, we buy 30 Ghana. 30 Ghana. Uh-huh. It is, we buy a lot. And the box of local tomato is bought at 50 Ghana. There's no factory here in Adan. If we had a factory, things would be much better. The traders, on the other hand, blame their low pricing on lack of markets. This is the season for tomatoes, but market is bad. I bought this basket for 60 cities. Transportation from the farm is 10 cities. Loading is 2 cities. And transportation to Accra is also 10 cities. Our checks revealed a box of tomatoes would have cost Madame Bruce Bill a total of 72 cities on a box to the Malamata markets where she retails it. Based on this calculation, I decided to check on the price of tomato at the Malamata market. We are currently at the Malamata market um, to find out how these retailers are actually selling the tomato on the market. And I have with me Auntie Julie to tell me how much she's selling her tomatoes. I bought a box of agri tomato today for 500 cities and the rhino for 300 cities. So I also sell the smallest bowl of the rhino for 5 cities and the agri for 7 cities. The big container of rhino sells for 20 cities while the agri is going for 25 cities. Patronage has been good. Madame Rose's box of tomatoes, which cost her a total of 72 cities, including transport from the farm, loading and to Accra, was sold to Auntie Rose for 500 cities, while her total cost of 62 cities went for 300 cities. Clearly, this is the tale of some local farmers working to the benefit of others. According to the Ministry of Food and Agriculture, Ghana imports between 50,000 to 70,000 metric tons of tomatoes from its neighboring Burkina Faso annually. The cost of this import is estimated at $99.5 million. The Planting for Food and Jobs policy seeks to address the declining growth of Ghana's agricultural sector. The policy also aims to provide marketing opportunities for produce after harvest and also offer ready market for farmers. But it appears some farmers are yet to benefit from this. And until then, some market women will continue to milk farmers of their soil. Sandra Sinamapenu, Joy Business.